Chrissy tweeted, one of these T-Pages need to post what her real ex said on her real Instagram. Because y'all are really ignoring the fact that Ish is in front of your face. Believing the fake page that me, Miller, and her ex have said already is fake. Now, before the interview that took place with Jesse, I apologize before anything. This account who knew Jesse's real account was stealing a lot of up-to-date pictures. And she was photoshopping a lot of receipts that made me believe what she was saying was right. The same messages y'all are seeing now, I already saw this. These were messages that she was sending me as if her... Her and Jamila were talking. That's why I believe this was the real Jesse. But when I spoke to the real Jesse before the interview, I did apologize. And I think that's why she was more open to have this conversation. Jesse made it very clear before this interview that she did not want her social media to be revealed. And not only that, she did not want to go lie. Now, this other Jesse that I was speaking to, she was so eager to tell me this story. That's why I was like, oh, okay, cool. So since she's open and honest and willing to talk about certain things, it would be better for us to go live. Because not only can I ask her questions, but the supporters can can ask her questions too but when I met the real Jesse she didn't want to be on live she just wanted to clear her name how do we know these receipts are actually from Miller's ex well upon request she posted up a picture a video and when I look back on her Instagram at previous videos and pictures which she didn't have that many because she had to make a lot of her pictures and videos private that she had with Jamila back in 2015 16 and 17 because these were the videos that people were stealing and they were making fake pages and posing as her but there was a few pictures that she had from 2015 that she had posted that was actually liked by Jamila from her real IG account. So there was a lot of evidence that showed that this was the real Jesse. If the ex didn't want any issues, why did she pop up? Jesse popped up because she wanted to clear her name and she didn't want people believing that she was in a relationship that she wasn't even in. Her and Miller have their own situations and according to her, she haven't spoken to Miller in a while. She haven't spoken to Miller, but Miller is still following her. They're not following each other on any social media platform. She said that she still loved Miller and they were broken up. She had no clue their relationship was over. This was a story that Jesse 4k which is the fake account was running with it's all fake i apologize for it i thought the girl had some solid receipts chrissy posted up screenshots and her and jamila didn't start talking until september now these are the screenshots that cassie is referring to she did address the fake page that i was telling y'all about jesse 4k she said no that page is fake what's the first ever picture you and miller took this november 12 2018 do you live with miller now this was taken at my house nope i still got my own crib i go there from time to time now i posted this video on my page and a lot of people had a lot to to say about this video and Chrissy took the time out to fully address that question make sure you stop pause and read her response but the reason why this question is being brought up so much is because Damo brought this up during a tweet she said that she didn't like when Chrissy smoked around areas that Dominic was going to be after she tweeted that out Chrissy responded back that she doesn't smoke but in a particular video where she was confronting Damo she had a black and mild in her hand which now she's saying that she does smoke black and mild the whole issue is that Damo didn't say what substance that she smoked she just said please do not smoke in areas that my child is gonna be. She didn't say that she smoked around the child. If you're smoking on a car and you have windows up, whether you have windows up or not, the smell is still lingering in the air. Black and mouth is so powerful. It's almost like a cigar smell. So if you're a person that's not used to that smell, you could become nauseous and very sick. So I understood where Damo was coming from. And that's why I addressed that in the previous video. That Damo wasn't saying that she smoked around the kid. She was saying that people can become very nauseous when they smell that smell, especially when they're not used to that smell. But when you have pride, and you don't want anybody to tell you anything things that were small that could have been resolved you turned into something real big but leave your comments down below let me know what you're thinking until next time peace